pests that harm plants can have an impact on everyone uh, without them actually realising it. Pests and diseases, uh, pathogens that harm plants can cause uh, significant losses to food crops, uh, lowering the amount of food that people have to eat. So really it's of concern to everyone. Um, and then where food isn't necessarily threatened, you have pests and diseases that harm plants in the wider environment. We all like to walk in the countryside and enjoy walking through the forests and in the woodland. And if that's um, harmed and threatened by um, organisms that can kill trees, environment is degraded and, and we all lose something, we all, you know, something is lost to us. Invasive species are a very important issue because they are playing havoc with our agriculture and also with biodiversity. So they have impact both on production and on the environment. Uh, in terms of uh, impact on agriculture, it has been estimated uh, there is about three trillion dollar loss every year globally because of invasive species. This is again a very conservative estimate. So the damage uh, pests could do would be um, killing plants, really completely killing killing a tree or something. But it could also do cosmetic damage, like um, making fruits looking very ugly, or it could um, also just start um, the, the beginning of, of an infestation with another organism, with, with, for example fungi, etc. So these are the, some kinds of damages. Uh, we have had uh, cases in the past uh, of you know, pests being introduced into the country and at least from an agricultural perspective we generally lose market opportunities. In terms of uh, natural areas We've had cases in the past. We had a case in the early 90s with the introduction of a pine beetle that pretty much devastated the natural pine in the mountain areas. And it was not just the destruction of a pristine ecosystem, but as well uh, it put at risk the watershed that you know feeds feeds the whole country with with, with, with fresh water for commercial, industrial, uh, and agricultural use. Bueno, eh, yo creo que todos los países han vivido las consecuencias de las plagas. Eh, las ha vivido el sector público cuando tiene que desembolsar grandes cantidades de dinero para hacer el control oficial y las sufre el sector privado que ve eh, reducido los rendimientos y ve complicados los mercados. Eh, por lo tanto, pienso que el análisis de riesgo bien hecho como una herramienta de focalizarse en forma efectiva en los riesgos eh, es de beneficio muy amplio, es de beneficio país, ¿verdad? es beneficioso tanto para los escasos recursos que tiene el sector público como para eh, el sector privado que quiere hacer eh, negocios en un ambiente seguro.